Hey guys, welcome back to another Rally with Rolly video. In this video, I'm gonna be uh, finally servicing my fork seals. If you've been following along, you know the fork seals on my WR250F have been leaking for a while. I figure it's about time I uh, address that issue because they're not leaking anymore. <laughs> I will also be checking and adjusting the valves if needed. So I've got uh, new seals there. The rod holder helped me in the disassembly and assembly and uh, seal driver put pound the new seals into the tubes. Sandpaper to, you know, if there's any nicks on the tubes, I'll sand that off and some seal guards. I'm excited to put them on. I have this hot cam shim kit, uh, feeler gauge. Uh, there's our checklist. Also, I'll be referring to the owner's manual, the service manual for my WR250F. Front tire off. You can see this thing's been leaking like a demon. So after, at least after today, it'll be cleaned. So here's the factory sill that come on the bike. Here's the tusk sill. Uh, after inspection, I think the tusk sill is better engineered. Uh, you'll see this little spring right there around the main sill part where it's going to keep that oil in. I think it'll work better. All right, to remove the plug to turn the crank so I can get to TDC, top dead center, uh, I didn't have an Allen wrench big enough for that. So I found a, uh, <clears throat> a bolt that fit that perfectly. I tried just using the lock nut style, two nuts to get together to see if they'd lock together, but it was spinning them both out. So I had to weld the nut on there and finally got that to break loose. Check this out. Uh, the tolerances for the intake are 0.12 to 0.19 millimeters, and the left side was 0.15. The right side, the right cam was 0.14 millimeters. The exhaust was 0.17 to 0.24 for the tolerance. I'm at 0.20 for the left cam and 0.19 for the right cam, so I'm still in spec. And I haven't adjusted them since I bought the bike, and it now has 5,356 miles. Oh yeah. All right, the bike's back in action and ready to rally. Uh, I wasn't looking too forward to changing those fork sails. I've never done it before, but I watched a couple YouTube tutorials and then uh, read the manual, and it was actually a lot easier than I anticipated. So 
We can check that one off the list. Fork seals, check. Uh, this little slide hammer, that come in handy to set the seals, little seal driver. I'm not gonna put the uh, dust seals on the forks. The tusk, the new seals look far superior than those stock seals I pulled out. So I'm thinking those new seals are gonna be a lot better. That was handy little cartridge tool. Uh, won't, didn't get to the shim kit, but the feeler gauge, man, that was a nice one. That one, uh, a lot of, man, from paper thin to extremely thick, so that worked out well. So, anyways, go adventure and go rally!